50,000 households signed up for Covered California on Tuesday, part of a last minute rush leading up to the big deadline on Monday. But there have been some changes in how that deadline is going to work. And here to tell us about it uh, during our business minute is Catherine Poitras of the business staff. Catherine, what, what happened today? today? Today, Covered California announced that they were going to give people who begin the enrollment process by midnight on Monday an additional two weeks to finish the process of applying. I see. And so if you get started, then you can finish up within a, a couple of weeks. Right, but the key is to get started before that deadline on March 31st. How long does it take? Is it like doing the taxes or what's the... Uh well, the problem is it's not that the process itself takes that long. I've heard estimates anywhere between 30 minutes to an hour, but there are a lot of people rushing, like you mentioned, to sign up here toward the very end. So that's slowing down the website, which is the place where most people are doing their enrollments. Didn't the officials and the people know what the deadline was all along? They did, but there's been additional outreach the last couple of months because the Latino community and the younger adult community for people aged between 18 and 34 hasn't been enrolling at the rates that they originally projected. So they've been trying to get more people to sign on and it's apparently working. And how does this fit in with the national picture? I mean, California has seemed to be ahead of the national uh, uh, outlook on this. Uh, how's that fitting in with their deadline? Right, well, we have bested all of our projections for California. Obviously, we want to get as many people signed up as possible, according to Cover California. But um, the federal exchange announced yesterday that they're also extending their deadline, which is part of the reason that California decided to extend its deadline. So everybody gets the extra two weeks. Right, as long as you get started before midnight Monday. Right. Then they'll be just in time to do their federal taxes. With your Business Minute, I'm Ricky Young, and this has been Catherine Poitras.